we believe we have a great book. We've worked very hard on it. Um, we have a team of people who spend the vast majority of, uh, of certainly the last year before it's published and probably the year before that. So almost two years out of every four that they spend uh, lots of their uh, living moments with this book. Uh, and not many people are willing to invest that much energy in writing a book and to try to drive for the rigor. And, you know, we uh, work with probably 200 other authors to make the book work. So you've got to have a lot of friends. You've got to have a lot of people to cooperate with. You've got to have people who trust in us, you know, to take the criticism we offer and to say they will deal with it and they do believe in it. Um, and uh, they share a lot of the same things I've discussed. They believe that participating is very useful for society. I mean, it doesn't have to be in a solid version. I'm a solid version type. It could be online. You offer it online. Uh, people can use it anyway, but I think it's a, uh, well, there aren't, there, there aren't any big books like this left anymore. The other, the people who were doing them maybe will do them again, but it, it, many people, as I said earlier, were led to believe that maybe books weren't the solution. You could do it just as well by an online chat such as this. I don't think this, this gets enough detail and it gets enough depth. I think that people learn when they really want to understand something, they have to go back and see what <coughs> people uh, 50 years ago thought about this when they had lots of these cases and the progress they made. And we try to discuss the progress in all these. We try to discuss what's happened. We try to give people a historical uh, uh, perspective. We try to give people a kind of depth that makes them want to be experts and makes them correct the errors we've made and change the world in their own fashion. And it gives people ideas. If you just take the, uh, the top of the cream of the, the idea, um, you know, it's not hard to um, get confused because you don't know how you got there. I think you, this, the objective is, is to learn how to learn, to think about things that others couldn't think about and to solve problems that others wouldn't have even looked at or addressed. I think you're trying to create, uh, to solve these problems, you need some revolutionaries, people who believe that the world can be better and aren't going to take compromises. So we try to take strong stands within the scientific boundaries that we think are fair. But we try to really take a firm stand about issues. And I think we are confident that we can go beyond what others might say. We do have a certain passion, but we think it's justified based upon the information we have.